said that my uh, car would be done this afternoon though. Oh, well, that's good, that's good. There's no problem picking you up though. Your house is right on the way to work, so it's all good. Oh, and guess what? What? I got employee of the month. Oh, really? Yeah, you know what that means? You get to park in the company parking spot? <laughs> exactly, man. There's no stopping me now. No parking in the boondocks, man. Straight on up from here. I'll be senior exec before you know it. Oh, well, good for you. Man, shut up. I'm not the one who crashed my car into a light pole. That wasn't my fault. I was rear-ended into that pole. Man, whatever. Look, we're here. Got my parking space. Finally. Oh, this feels so good. Carter, I need to talk to you in my office. Carter, do you know why I've called you in here today? No, sir. Why? You should know, Carter. How long have you been working here, Carter? All since this past summer, so about uh nine months. Well then you know very well that the employee code of conduct at Megacorp is very strict. You know this, right? Yes. Yes? Yes what? Yes sir. Better. Now, would an employee following the Megacorp code of conduct vandalize another fellow employee's car? Sir, I don't see where this is going. Don't play stupid with me, Carter. Just take a look at these security videos I have on my computer. This is unacceptable behavior, Carter. Therefore, I am obliged to take away your prestigious title of Employee of the Month and transfer it to someone more qualified for it. But I never even got to use my parking spot! Carter, you don't have a right to use that spot. You're Employee of the Month next month. I mean, you were. No! 